Poppets, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is all about geek gear. We are opening the li 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 limited edition Love is in the Air box. We have an extra box too. Now, I have been loving Geek Gear's limited edition boxes just recently. I do really, really, I have been really enjoying them. Um, so let's hope that this box also makes me smile and happy. But before we see what magic and love is inside this box for us, if this is the first time you've seen my face, hello and welcome to my channel. If you love anything to do with Harry Potter, this is the place for you. Join the magic and mayhem on this channel, hit subscribe because I'd love to have you. A massive thank you to these guys. These guys are my Patreons. They help me keep this channel running just that little bit more. If you'd like to know anything about Patreon, it's linked in the description of this video, along with my social medias. Go see what I'm up to on those. But yeah, I, like I said, I have been loving their limited edition boxes. This box, look at the love hearts. We've got, oh, we've got a love potion brewing here. And on the front, we've got some very, very happy witches and wizards there on their brooms. I'd be very happy too. Flying, hi, free. Uh, don't know what the hints were because if you've been here a while with me, you know I'm rubbish. But it just makes it more of a mystery, okay? It makes it more of a mystery. But we're gonna put this one to the side and we're gonna start with this because this, I believe, is a wand. It's gonna be quite a posh wand maybe, hopefully. I don't know, we'll see. But we always do these boxes last, if it's a wand anyway. We always do ones last. So yeah, let's open this boot tray. First look, guys, ready? Oh, there we go. Oh, right, we've got a black t-shirt. We've got a black t-shirt. Let's pull the t-shirt out and let's have a look. Oh, it's not a t-shirt. It's not a t-shirt, it's a long sleeve top. And I'm quite excited about that, to be fair. So what we got, we have got a candle. We've got, oh, hang on. Is this, correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, guys, but is this the fish bowl? with the lily petal. Is it? Am, am I being silly? Am I having a moment? Guys, tell, I know you'll tell me in the comments. Pre just tell me in the comments if I'm wrong, but I think that's it. I do quite like this though. I do quite like that. I don't know what it is that I like. I can't explain what I like, but I really, really like that design. Maybe because it's magical looking. Is it the lily leaf in the fishbowl? You know when the fishy dies, Professor Slugon tells the story? Uh, okay, let me know in the comments, guys. Or it might tell us on the cheat sheet anyway. But um, I do really like that. What do you think? I think I'm excited as well because it's long-sleeved. I think you get them in the wearable boxes. I think you get long-sleeved sometimes in those. But apart from that, we don't. if you don't get the wearable or special edition, you don't tend to see long sleeve top so I'm rather happy about a long sleeve top in this box but I do quite like that design let me know what you think in the comments though guys my hands going back in the box oh yeah for full disclosure forgot about this bit um this box was gifted to me to review for you guys but obviously all opinions will be my own right I'm pulling something out Ooh, this is soft and it's in a oh is this a you give me butterflies. Okay, so this is a pin banner. Now, that's quite cool. We, <laughs> you give me butterflies. Um, So it's Bow Batten themed. I'm just trying to think. Obviously, last year we had a pin every month. Um, Yeah, we had a pin every month last year. And uh, we got, in the January, we got a pin banner. And it said why couldn't it have been follow the butterflies and obviously all the pins that i got every month and what have you went on that pin banner so i have a a year's worth of pins on my geek gear banner which is really really cool so we do have another pin banner i am really confused because january we didn't get a cheat sheet so i don't know what's going on this year with a monthly themed item maybe february's box this month's box will make more sense to me but we'll soon find out but yes i am very happy with that because you must have heard me geek gear because i did say that we're going to need another pin banner and we have one now thank you oh okay what's this we have some socks okay you are unforgettable 
I don't understand. Maybe the cheat sheet will explain a bit more. Um, these look a bit like macaroons. You know them macaroons? I've never actually ate, ate a macaroon, but I know what they look like, and they look like macaroons to me. I'm confused. You're unforgettable. Nothing's coming to mind for me here. Is it something to do with lavender? No. I don't... I'm not sure. I quite like them, though. They're quite funky, but I'm not quite sure. Fingers crossed the cheat sheet. If not, guys, help me out in the comments again. Um, I swear, though, that long sleeve top's playing on my mind. I'm sure it's Lily in the fishbowl. I'm sure it is. Okay, hand is going back in. What do we have here? Ooh, looks like we've got a medal. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, so on here, we've got a cauldron. It says anything for love. And then here, bloody hell. Um, and obviously it's a quote that Ron says a lot. Ah. Uh, I'm unsure on the medal. Um, now they did a sorting medal. Um, obviously I got Ravenclaw in my box. I can't remember what box this was in, but we got this medal and I thought it was such a fantastic idea because, um, in, I don't know, it was like you were sorted and you got a medal for being sorted into your house and you got your house medal. I don't quite understand this one and that doesn't look very valentines -y to me i'm not quite sure i'm not not sure on the medal not gonna lie let's carry on with the box though guys let's have a look okay so there is another okay oh, okay so this i think is coasters now they have done coasters before i think i've got two or three sets of coasters of theirs i can't remember but i'm i love the artwork on them so is the artwork going to be as nice on oh they're different as well the other ones were like um like you know the corky the cork bottomed coasters these are like a silicon okay so not just a pretty face courageously cuddly okay i am liking these and then we've got ravishing wrist risk taker and we've got light-hearted loyal lover okay not gonna lie i do I, i've liked the coasters that we've been getting obviously these are different and they're round the other ones we got were square were they all square i can't remember um but these are really really cool i love what they're made of too i've got a lot of condensation in my box i think it's because it's so cold but um hang on let me get the condensation off but yeah i really like these these are really nice. Oh, I do like them. Condensation off. Condensation. Yeah, I do really like them coasters. They're nice and thick as well. They're really well made. And I love the artwork. I love the little quotes on them. Not just a pretty face. Lighthearted, loyal lover. Courageously cuddly and ravishing risk taker. I do like Slytherins. Okay, no, I do like them coasters. They're really cool. Okay, what else have we got? I must remember we have a wand. Okay, we have a pin. Oh, I like this. Oh, my first look, I was like, what's this got to do with Valentine's? And then I read the caption on it. Quite the catch okay i really like that pin all valentine's aside that pin is so nice quite the catch oh that is really cool oh it's even got little love hearts look on the banner at either side of ah oh, no i do really like that is a cool pin i mean putting the quote aside quite the catch the actual glove catch it obviously harry catching the snitch it'll be um, I don't think I've seen a pin like that done before. Some of you might have done, but I don't think I have. So that is really cool. The backing card's cool as well. And I loved how, like, it's all blurred out in the back. Ah, oh, that is really cool. No, I really love that pin. I do really, really love that pin. Right, what else have we got? I'm going to just look. Oh, what is this? We've got a magnet. Okay. I'm not going to moan at a magnet because I do like him. <laughs> You make me howl. <laughs> oh dear, the little things. I do quite like this magnet. You make me howl. I like what they've done there. I do like what they've done there. It's kind of like a silicon as well. That is going straight on my fridge. I, I don't have many magnets actually. 
Oh, that is so... I like that. I really like that idea. Very funny geek gear. Very funny. Okay, we have a print and it's framed. I love it when they get them framed for us. Dave's just going out and doing it ourselves. Let's have a look. Okay. Oh, I actually quite like this. I'm just going to take it out of this. Uh, so the studio light doesn't, it will probably still glare because of the glass on the frame. But let me see if I can do it. There we go, look. I'm all tension. So this is where, obviously, Ron takes the love potion uh, without knowing it's in the chocolate, isn't it? Um, <laughs> I like that because it's one of my favourite scenes with Ron because he just, it, he's funny. He does a really good job with that. Rupert Grint did a really good job with that. I do quite like that. I do like that print. I'm definitely going to put that on my art wall. Yeah, that's really cool. Okay, I think we've come to the end of the box, but we do have another box and then we'll get onto the cheat sheet. So we have this box. Okay, the ones have been really hit and miss. Now, we got a wand in January's box and I really liked it. And then a few people in the comments said it looks like a wand they've done before. Like, seriously, looks like a wand they've done. And it did. And to be quite honest, when I was filming it, it did. Like, I, I thought, I'm sure I've got a wand like this. But I didn't say anything because I was really unsure. But when a few of you started commenting that they'd done it, I thought, well, they must have done. And somebody kindly sent me a picture of the other wand uh, to save me going to find it, the one in, that I've got here. And, yeah, it was very similar, but it was still a really nice wand. But, yeah, the wands have been really hit and miss. So, oh, gosh, I'm scared. Oh, no. Okay, okay. It's a heart and the veins are going down the wand. Um, hang on. Do you know what? I actually really love the style of this wand. I tell you what put me off when I first opened it. It was this. Because like with the medal. And there's, there's blood dripping off that. I mean... I don't know. It. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. It's not screaming Valentine's for me. Um. I don't know how I feel. I love the style of it. I love this all down here. It looks so nice. It's very very well painted as well. I'm just not sure about the heart at the top of the wand. I. D I don't know. I don't know. It's just personal preference. But yeah, it's not a bad paint job and I do like the style of it and I really like these viney bits. I'll tell you what it kind of reminds me of. Hermione's wand a little bit. Don't you think? Don't you think? But I do love the style. I love the colour. Um, It's just the heart at the top that I'm not keen on, I think. But other than that, it's a great style. So, guys, I'm just going to put that to the side. Just going to double check. That is it. We have come to the end of the box. So let's read the cheat sheet. So, Happy New Year, you lovely creatures. Thank you for purchasing this Geek Gear limited edition Love is in the Air box. We hope these lovingly crafted, crafted, <laughs> crafted Valentine's themed crates strike you right in the feels like Cupid's arrow. This is our first limited edition box of 2022 and we feel we've managed to fit some really great references in here to help you connect with the Valentine's vibes from all around the wizardry, wizardry world. We hope you agree. As always, we hope that witches and wizards of any age can feel the love this Valentine's Day with our wonderful limited edition box. Thank you for your support during an incredibly challenging few years. Here's to unpacking the mysteries. All the best for the rest of 2022 with love. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so number one, yes, Lily in the fishbowl t shirt. It's not a t shirt, it's a long sleeve top. I'll, but I'll let you off, I'll let you off. I was right, yes. <sighs> License and exclusive Amortentia print. I did quite like that just because I like that scene with Ron. Unique ones, heartstrings wand. I love the design, I'm really undecisive with this. I love the design. I think it's a really cool looking wand. It's just because it's a heart at the top. It's putting me off like an actual heart. You couldn't have done this with a heart, you know, just your love heart shape. Because it would have looked weird. So it's better than using that. But I don't know. There's something about a heart on a wand. 
I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Um, but I do like the style of it. I've got mixed feelings. I do really like it, but I'm just not keen on the heart. And I'm just repeating myself now. Um, and then we have the Anything for Love Enchanted Pendant. I'm going to be honest. I'm not keen on that. I'm not keen on that. And then we've got the Quite the Catch Enamel Pin. Really love that pin. I thought it's a fantastic idea. I love what they've done with it. It's really cool, that is. Then we've got the School Houses Romantic Traits Coaster Set. Love that. I've been loving their coasters. I know it might not be for everybody. You might think, Susie, you're getting excited over coasters. I'm an adult and I have a house and things, little things like that really please me, okay? But I do really like the Coaster Traits Set. And then we have the Howl With Laughter Magnet. I do really, where is it? There it is. You make me howl. I That is such an amazing, such an amazing magnet. I do like that. Forget Me Not Socks. Right, I'm still confused about the socks then. If you can let me know in the comments, I'd really appreciate it. Thank you in advance. And then the You Give Me Butterflies banner. Okay, it just says banner, but... I'm going to use it as a pin banner, but I won't cover the words. I won't get many pins on it then, will I? I will. I'm going to use it as a pin banner. That's what I'm using it for because it's exactly the same. It, I mean, it, they've just put banner, but it might be pin banner. But, you know, you know. What did you think to this box? What did you think to the box as a whole, guys? Let me know in the comments. I'm just going to take a moment to process everything and then we're going to talk about it. Okay, I have got everything, everything laid out in front of me. Um, I don't think it's the strongest limited edition box they have done so just recently. Um, I've not been wowed, if you know what I mean. I know that I was wowed a bit in the other limited edition boxes. Um, but this one hasn't for me, but that's just personal preference. But I did enjoy this box. I did enjoy this box, and that is the main thing. Looking at it, yeah. We did get some nice items in this box. I'm still looking at the wand and it's really bugging me because I love the wand. I love it. It's just the heart on the end. Again, repeating myself, but you know me by now. Um, I love the banner. Again, it's always nice to have somewhere new to put your pin badges. Um, least favourite, I'm going to say the pendant or medal. To me, anything for love bloody hell I, I don't I don't quite get that so that's my least favorite the socks I don't understand but I do like the style of them um and I definitely will wear them are they macaroons are they can somebody like tell me what this is the top really like again I think because it's a long sleeve top as well it excites me because I do like a good long sleeve top um I love my t-shirts but I have a lot of geek gear t-shirts a lot um, I don't have many long sleeves, so this is quite nice. And I love that I got it right and I was unsure. <sighs> Lily Fish Bowl! I love the print, the pin, the coasters. They really excite me. And I love the, the fridge magnet. I did enjoy this box. It just wasn't the strongest limited edition box just recently. Um, but yeah, let me know what you think in the comments to this box, guys. Do you think it was a strong one for you? If it was, then awesome! But yeah, my least favourite item is definitely the pendant or medal, whatever you want to call it. My favourite item I'm actually going to struggle with because there's a few items in here that I really, really love. Um, it's out of the pin, the magnet and the coasters. I think I'm going to say the pin. I think the pin's my favourite, just because going on a reaction, I think the pin excited me more when I saw it, because I didn't quite understand it when I first saw it, like, what is it to do with Valentine's, but then obviously when I read the bottom, it was like, okay, I get it, I do really like that pin, I don't know, I, yeah, we're gonna, we'll stick with it, that's my first one I've picked, so we're gonna stick with it, so the pin is my favourite, the medal is my least favourite, what was your favourite and least favourite? Let me know in the comments. Did you like the box as a whole? Again, let me know in the comments. Let Geek Gear know. Because I'm sure they'll read the comments. Um, but yeah, that's it. I'm, I, yeah, I'm quite happy with this. The one that really I didn't like was the medal. But the rest of it, even the wand, I do like it. Just not keen on the heart. Repeat it again. But I'm going to go now, guys. And I'm going to um, have a coffee. I don't know why I'm real enough, what I'm doing now. But there we go. We're doing this. Going to have a coffee. And I'm going to edit this video and get it up for you guys to see.
talk to me in the comments you know i love it when you do and i will speak to you all in my next video thank you for watching bye pods puppets